Good morning guys, como están? We just woke up, we washed the pots, my hands are. We're having a beautiful day, but we were yesterday night talking with the people in the camping. Some of them said to us that there are chances that there will be snow. We already had a really cold night. The tent, the inside of the tent was freezed. All right guys, we're back in the road. And as I told you before, we had made a little change of plans. We are very likely going to the glacier until late and then we're coming back at night so we can enjoy the sunset if it is possible because there might be snow and everything will depend on the weather conditions and at this altitude a storm could be fatal that's why we always have to look for security then the pictures and everything else It's our second day in the Andes mountains and after hiking for two hours and a half we will reach the Piedra Carvajal camping. From there we will walk for two more kilometers until we reach the altitude of 3500 meters above sea level. And that will be the place where we will see the glacier. We have been walking for about 45 minutes now and we are reaching a place called the waterfalls. Those waterfalls are where the river flows from and of course behind the waterfalls is where this sulfur mine or whatever it is uh, is <laughs> right over there are the waterfalls and yes there we can see a glacier we just arrived to the waterfall of sulfur and to the hardest part of the trekking where we'll climb up the mountain To, time to begin climbing the snow, which is actually it's not that hard, but it is really solid, it's kind of icy, so I'm just gonna stop filming meanwhile until we are at the top. I just met some friends from uni, so that's really cool. Piedra Carvajal it is this one right behind here and the fun thing about this one is that it is actually a massive giant rock that fell from the mountain stood here suspended, suspended in between this one and the one that's behind it and people here use it as a shelter they built some walls around it so they can hide from the from the rough weather that is here in the upper side of the Andes Mountains, right over there is the glacier where we are going to. So we are about two kilometers from it, we're gonna have some rest and right after it we're going to the top. Not, not, not to the top of the glacier, no way. architecture and he said to us, he noticed that this is made with 
that weed over there. So that's basically what the cattleman used to build this refuge, this shelter about a hundred years ago. So they could hide. right over there it's massive it really is it goes from the 3400 meters up to the almost 5,000 meters high it's insane we uh, wait there are a couple of things I want to do first image because there's a cloud coming inside the body and that's not good it doesn't look good at all so let's take it right now there we go bracketing and beautiful image Alright guys, we're finishing the video here because that cloud doesn't look good and we just will go down. The, the first idea was to stay here until sunset, but that's not going to happen, not in these weather conditions. But look at this, beautiful, 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 beautiful place we are. Thank you for joining me and I hope that you enjoyed this video as much as I did. Remember, like, share and subscribe. The three things that you have to do so I keep doing these kind of videos. One more thing, the very last one. My friends, go nature, go raw. See you next week. mountain up there the uh, scream cloud that we had before it's gonna look awesome and what we're going to do here is that I take the picture give me a few minutes to settle everything and I'm gonna give away this image to every single one of you that subscribe like and send an email to you and it gives me your email so I can send it to you give me one second Tensile filter in that hill. I really don't know what's gonna be out of this. It takes like six minutes. Let's hear how it goes. There's only one chance to take this picture. But if not, there you go. Look at that. Absolutely stunning. image guys the sun is gone and look at this the cloud is coming to us once again and this is how it has been the whole evening I wanted to take a picture like this long ago but I thought I almost gave up but thankfully we had that last moment of pure beauty write your email below and I will send it to you bye bye